Uh, my name is Summer Johnson, and we live in Fern Creek. My son attends the Academy at Shawnee, sixth grade this year. We love it. He and his friend Gabe are two stops away from each other on the bus. They both go. Um, unfortunately, if this comes through, they could not continue their education at the high school. And it's an amazing, one-of-a-kind opportunity that those two children have. And it was our choice for them to ride an hour and 15 minutes every day, each way. And they love it. They do their homework on the bus, which is good too, but <laughs> it gives them that time. But it's absolutely, positively a very important issue in our house. Yeah. Every school we've looked at for Liam is one of the ones that could potentially be affected. So for us, not only Jackson and going on after middle school, but for Liam, where we were thinking about middle schools and another elementary school for him, all of those are on the list of schools that could potentially be affected yep. by mm -hmm. 151. Shawnee Middle School is actually not a protected magnet either. Is it not, so not the middle school? When they start busing, uh, when they stop busing and have the neighborhood kids fill that school, which has like 2,600 students or something. Yeah, well, the West End doesn't have Yeah, there schools. aren't any middle schools, so um, those magnet programs will no longer be an option for a lot of our families that have been uh, utilizing them. So uh, 